Uh, it gets, it feels really, really good to get that silverback gorilla <laughs> off of our back. <laughs> you know, so so often we, we feel like we're kind of in games or the way we prepare and kind of knowing who are, who we are, like as a team, we go in knowing or feeling that this is a, this is a game that we should win. We felt that again tonight and um, really, really proud of the effort from start to finish by our team. In the first few games, you know, we'd go up or we'd have a lead. And then when we went behind, we would then kind of hang our heads and take ourselves out of it a little bit and then kind of fight back. We didn't do that tonight. That's very, in the coach's opinion, what or who we believe that our team <coughs> is. And this was such a good win for us because we are becoming who we are. And um, if we continue to play like this, I feel really good about us putting some wins together. So really excited for now our first year kids to kind of have an example of what's necessary to win in the ACC and in the level in which you have to play at. Coach, I think you guys were down eight in the last like three or four minutes. So what went right in those final minutes that allowed you to come back? Us being who we are defensively. We cause problems for people when we really want to. And then us coming down and executing. We slowed down and executed our plays and ran them almost to perfection. And then when the first few options weren't there, we just played basketball after that and just made some, some really big plays. I think the team forced 28 turnovers. What was going so right defensively? Uh, our activity. I mean, that's not something that we're surprised by or um, is unfamiliar for us. When we decide to play defense the way that I know that we can, it looks like that. And um, so I'm not shocked by that because we kind of pretty much took to the scout. And even when they made shots, we didn't divert from that. We continue to do things the way that we practiced all week because when you do the things the way that you're supposed to, good things happen. And um, just really proud of our kids today. Yeah, Coach, uh, down the stretch there, uh, Dominique and Jocelyn both hit big shots for you. And just what is, how does it help this team, you know, just have these senior players that kind of level the team, especially in these crunch moments? Oh, it means everything. I mean, these guys had a really long year last year and playing out of position and not being able to kind of be completely who they are. And us now getting in recruits and being able to substitute and then put people in, in different positions and then them be able to kind of be solid in those, in those positions allows um, Nikki as well as Josh <laughs> to kind of be themselves like more often. They were playing like two, three, maybe four positions last year. And that's just a lot for any player, no matter how good you are. But them being able to kind of be true to who they are and get to the shots that they're most comfortable with or they've been working on all year gives them a certain level of confidence and also the fact that every now and then we can give them a break. Jocelyn and then uh, Dominique, just the way y'all started ACC, it wasn't, I know it's not how you wanted to, but what does it mean to get a win, especially like this where it came down to the very end? Yeah, I think you know it feels good to finally get that first win. Um, you know, the first few games weren't ideal. We felt like they were winnable games and we were close and we just didn't get over that hump. But you know, now that we have this win, it, as Coach said, it kind of gives us sets a precedent for our next few games and what it takes to win. Um, yeah, so we're we're excited and looking forward to that. Yeah, sort of what Justin and Coach said before. Um, we weren't ourselves those first couple games, and like it showed in the stat sheet and it so, showed in the final score. Um, and tonight was kind of one of those games where we <coughs> finally found ourselves and found what it took to win um, these ACC games and just come together as a team and get these Ws. Yeah, I mean, we've been in some close games, and I think, you know, definitely our non conference schedule helped us to have that toughness getting into the final minutes. Um, but I think today it, we said to each other, you know, defense, that's what's going to win this game. And so I think we played pretty solid defense for most of the game, but definitely picked up another another level in the final three minutes or so to get stops and then just come down and execute on the other end. So just I'm really proud of our maturity and growth in that respect. I think that's something that we were lacking 
in our <coughs> you know, the past three games or even some others that were winnable. Um, but to come out on top and just show that maturity is, is great for us. Jocelyn, again, uh, what is the mindset when you have the ball, when you have a shot like that, down by three, what goes through your head in that moment? I mean, in the moment, I'm not thinking about the score or the time too much. Um, it's a shot that I practice. And just for me, knowing that I have the confidence to take that shot because I, I get up plenty of shots. Um, and I've been, you know, we've again, we've had so many close games where it's come down to a big shot like that. So just know that my teammates trust me to get a great pass. Lisa had an amazing pass. Um, and just being in rhythm and just shooting it. I know when I'm in rhythm, it's more than likely a good shot. So, Dominique, can you take me through your assist late in the game? I think it was to Carroll to take a 61 to 59 lead. And, and mm -hmm. what's it feel like to make the pass and then also to have Carroll make the basket? Right. Um, I think a lot of times my turnovers come from either me going too slow, meaning I'm telegraphing the pass, or going too fast, or it just slips out my hand. I think that pass was just right in the sweet spot where like I saw the game, I saw how the defense was moving, and I knew that she was going to be open. And she was, and she saw me, and she got the bucket. So yeah, it was just playing at, with a level head and playing with the game. Justin, is there a sense that you know, there's kind of a monkey off your back here that you mm -hmm. got this win? And, and how do you take this momentum now going forward on the road? Yeah, gorilla, I mean, gorilla, not monkey. <laughs> gorilla. <laughs> I mean, I think we all have big expectations for, for this season. So to come out and start ACC and not live up to some of those expectations is a disappointment. But now it's kind of like clear vision. I think the biggest difference between this game and others is that everyone contributed. Um, from the bench production, first years. We, we sat down and told them the other day, you're not a first year anymore. You're basically a second year. So everybody has to step up and contribute. And so now that we know what it looks like and what it takes, it's just exciting because we can we can just keep building and building. Um, and so looking forward to these next few games, it's we're building. <laughs> we're building. Building on one, <laughs> one game on top of the other. Absolutely. Yeah, Coach, pretty much the same thing. How do you build off this? I know after the UNC game, you talked it wasn't y'all's best performance, but how do you keep building off a game like this? Well, I mean, it, growth was necessary for us. Like, we're basically a new team, and we have three seniors, and we have, what, seven, eight first years until we got um, Tiana. So that's not easy you know like these guys mentally are on two different planes you know these guys have seen it all our first years haven't seen anything so it was going to take a while for kind of us to get um, cohesive it was going to take uh, a little while for our first year kids who were all everything where they came from to now come into the situation and have to take direction you know like it was a process it was these guys learning how to communicate with seven of them like seven at one time is a lot, you know, and them trusting the leadership and the fact that they've seen it before. And I think with each, each game out, we're kind of getting better at that. And now that they have an example of what it is they've been talking about, what we've been talking about as a staff, they can kind of like see it. So now there's a reference just kind of to the work, to the effort, and the level in which it takes. And it's necessary for us to kind of win in the ACC, but also be able to kind of string wins together.